Hey Wendell teachers, I wanted to take a minute uh, this afternoon and explain something that the Red Wolves team has brought to my attention, uh, or re-brought to my attention. Uh, it's called GradeCam, and they've uh, revamped this, this service in recent months. Uh, and it's now both a website and an app, which the app part makes this thing really powerful. Uh, it's kind of like having a Scantron in your pocket. You only need to have one device. So I, I've noticed a lot of teachers lately have been checking out whole sets of iPads or laptops um, to assess kids, uh, which is great using things like Socrative, which is, which is a great thing. Um, but it becomes somewhat cumbersome to uh, put a device in the hands of each kid, especially when things are reserved. So this only requires you to have one device uh, for you as a teacher. Uh, it's a free service, um, like I say, and it, like I said, it links directly to PowerSchool. So I'm going to have you, uh, I'm going to show you how uh, Miss Patterson used it in her math class, and how Cavelli uh, is going to show you how to link it up directly with PowerSchool. So check this out. So Great Cam, I can use my phone or the document camera, and they fill in a bubble sheet, kind of like EOGs, so practicing with the bubbles and I can come around and scan their form either with a document camera or with my phone and it grades it automatically um, for me. Well, the document camera worked the other day, but <laughs> with the lighting, the phone is working much better and I can come to the student's desk and grade it and show them on the phone, here's your score, let's look at the ones you missed. So it was easier to go around each student and look at it that way. So on the GradeCam, it's a website, you, it's free to log in, and when you go on, you can print the students' forms with their numbers. So I printed these before they took their test and passed them out. So you created, by putting in the, your roster mm -hmm. in GradeCam's yes. website, yeah. and that you gives you... You can copy the roster right off PowerSchool and upload it into GradeCam. You can print blank forms, and the students could fill their number in. But just to make it easier, I just went ahead and printed the forms for the students already. Um, I actually went through and individually put their numbers in because the student ID number was hard for me to figure out and copy, but it only took me like 10 minutes to upload all four of my classes. So what I did this time is I made four different forms of the test. So they each have a different form at their table. So when I'm marking his, it doesn't match any of the other students that are at his table. And by filling in the form number at the top, we can make sure that they all have different forms. So it's the same test, but the questions are in different yes. orders. Yeah. yeah, I just did the same test and I just cut and paste them and put them in a different order. Okay. It takes a little bit longer to set up the test because you have to do, because I did the four different forms. But then afterwards with grading and test corrections, it's a lot easier. I can grade them right there in class. Um, I, I like GradeCam better because they can immediately see their score, whereas Socrative, it's all in your computer, so that you have to kind of tell them their score, so it's not something they can see right away. Um, and the reports on GradeCam, it gives you a ton of reports on the computer. So when you go through, you can break it down by question number and by each student and see which question more of them got right than another question. Awesome.